I got a text, I see you, right when I got out of the shower. I've had some serious with a stalker in my past when I was about 14, a homeschooled boy who lived close to my house and was very socially awkward. Me and my friends were very dumb and thought the whole situation was funny at first. We thought he was just obsessed with me because of his crush, but never realized how creepy he was. We often answered his calls. He called me 25 times and more a day. I was at a sleepover, so we called him to mess with him. Yes, I realize this is a horrible thing, but I was so young. We would just ask him dumb questions, like if he stalked me and why he was so obsessed with me. Once we were being so dumb and said that we were having a party at my house and he instantly got angry and said he could come over there and take everyone out with his pistol and no one would know. We were a little stunned, but me and my friends brought it on. We would say, you wouldn't be able to get here and he instantly rebuttaled saying he was already here. My house is surrounded by trees and is in the country and we heard through the phone a car door shut and was sounding like him running. We started laughing saying that he wasn't scaring us, but he said he was at my house and was watching us. We laughed once more until we heard a knock at the door. This is when reality hit us and we actually started to become scared. My friend and I are still laughing and saying that's a good one. I didn't know how to react because it didn't make sense of how he could just be messing with us. My friend went to go open the door and I yelled at him to stop. He didn't listen to me and insisted it was a joke, so he went to go open the door and screamed. I grabbed my phone and called the police. My friend came back laughing. I was so confused. She said, I'm just messing with y'all. Nobody is there. My heart was pounding. And I said, thank goodness. But I told my friend that wasn't funny. My friend left immediately so I could get in the shower. I received a strange text while in the shower. I checked my phone and noticed I was still on the phone with the police. Oh shit, I said. So I grabbed the phone and I tried telling them that I'm okay. But they said that they already sent out two cops to check on me. I told them it was a mistake, but they said it's too late and they're already on their way. I said, I'm sorry and hanged up. I checked the text and it was from that guy saying, enjoying your shower? My heart starts to race. Then I see a shadow run from behind my closed door. I run out of the shower and grab the towel. I heard a knock on the door and they yell, it's the police. They asked me, do you know this boy? And it's the stalker boy. The police said they found him roaming around my house and said, thank God we found him when we did and had the boy in handcuffs. I asked, why officer? The officer tells me because they found a pistol on him saying that he is a mass murderer. He shot some kids at a school for the fun of it and they were unable to find him. That explains why he's always been homeschooled. I couldn't believe what I was hearing. But every night I thank God for being alive because I realize life isn't a luxury, it's a gift.